There is nothing like it in the world. I have said on television that Masters, the Masters Golf Tournament is considered perhaps the greatest in the world. And I have said that the Boston Marathon is to running what the Masters is to golf. And without any further ado, after so many wonderful years, we are delighted to have back again the very best runners in the world, many of them from Kenya, to come out here to Elmwood and share this wonderful event with you. You've done a great job in your preparation. And without further ado, let's meet these great runners. Let's give a great welcome to Daniel Salam. Last year, she finished among the top seven in the marathon. Children and youngsters from Elmwood, please greet with me, Valentine Kipkader. This man is considered one of Kenya's really outstanding great future talents. Please greet with me his first time here to run the Boston Marathon, Joffrey Kirui. For the first time, let's help her on her way to a great performance. Please greet with me, Bridget Koske. This next man can run from Hopkinton right here at Elmwood School all the way to Wellesley and do it in less than an hour. Sammy Kitwara. She has been ranked among the world's best in three successive years. Gladys Chirono. Please greet with me back again to try and win the Boston Marathon, Wilson Chabat. Now you're going to meet one of the fastest marathoners in history, Emmanuel Mutai. She has won in London, and in New York City, and in Los Angeles, and we are delighted to welcome her back to Boston. Ladies and gentlemen, greet with me, Edna Kiplagai. I need your love. He won the 2012 Boston Marathon. He decided to run for parliament in his country of Kenya. Ladies and gentlemen, Wesley Career. She is the 2015 Boston Marathon Champion. We are delighted to invite her back. Young boys and girls, how about a big Elmwood welcome for Caroline Rotich. The Kenyans show us that dedication and hard work pays off. They show us that supporting and respecting each other is important in all aspects of life. The Kenyans demonstrate that sometimes you must reach beyond your comfort zone to achieve your full potential. They personally inspire me to run and to run as fast as I can. Thank you to the Kenyan runners for taking the time to inspire us and show us how one single race can connect us all. Good luck to everyone running on Monday. Thank you. So for me, I can't run a marathon yet. And maybe for you, if you don't like running, it's I can't do my multiplication tables yet. 
But if you set your mind to it and work extremely hard every day, you'll get those multiplication tables. It's an incredible privilege to live here in Hopkinton where the Boston Marathon starts. I hope you get to go to the Common on one day and see these world-class athletes perform and maybe talk with them and experience their runner's attitude. Thank you. It is, it it is, is a great, great pleasure, pleasure to announce that Elmwood School has had its best year raising money for the Kang Kids, Kids Foundation, Foundation and it is presenting Wesley career with the donation of four thousand one hundred sixty one dollars and twelve But it's an honor, and I am so thankful that you guys think about Kenya, and I am so thankful that you have chosen Kenya Kids Foundation to be a project for you guys to raise money. For the last three years, I've been honored to be able to come here and receive money that you guys have sacrificed. This money goes to giving other kids an opportunity to get education. Kenya is a country that education is not free like here. We have to pay to go to school, and a ton of kids do not get a chance to go to school. For the last five years, since when we formed the Kenya Kids Foundation with my wife, we have been able to take over 385 students to school and to go to university. As I'm speaking right now, last year we had about five students who came to American University, who are now studying in American University under full scholarship because you guys gave them a chance when they were young to get an education. So clap for yourself.